like I said the other day, we watched, or you watched, I wasn't here, a frictionless baseball game. And, and if you didn't have friction, you would just slide around. You couldn't run. You couldn't walk. You couldn't... You couldn't stop yourself. You couldn't and, always get And when you, like think about this, when you are like at a football field or a baseball field or you're playing outside and you roll the ball to your friend and they miss it, does the ball keep rolling forever? Yes. 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 Forever? Yes. Okay, a gate could stop it, but what else stops it? Like if we throw the ball from one end of the football field and it rolled, is it going to just keep rolling forever? No. no. But there's nothing up there to stop it. So what's going to make it stop, Logan? The grass. The grass. The grass. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. The grass causes friction on there. And I rolled the Hot Wheels on the desk. Then I rolled some on the floor, and then I rolled some on the tile outside in the hallway. Are they all going to roll the same? No. Why? Why wouldn't they all roll the same? Raise your hand if you can tell me why. Maya. Because maybe some, um, maybe um, the one that on the carpet maybe Okay, she thinks the ones on the carpet might not roll. Cora? They will roll. Okay, she's saying that the ones on the desk will roll, but the ones on the floor she thinks won't roll. Emma, what were you going to say? If you put it on the tile, then it'll probably go fast because it's kind of slick. Okay, so she used a good word. I like the word that she just used. She didn't just tell me that it will roll on there. She kind of told us why, didn't she? What word did she use that kind of told us why? Slick. So if things are slick, that means that there's not as much friction. So when things are rough, like the carpet, then there's not, there's a lot of friction, right? So here's what I want you to do. I want you to look at the bottom of your shoes. Just flip your shoe over so that you can see the bottom of it. Now, some of your shoes have what's called tread on them. And if you have tennis shoes on, your tennis shoes have a lot of tread. Even my dress shoes have tread on them. And why do you think that our shoes have tread? Why do you think that they have tread? Because they stop you. Go to the bathroom. Look, look. Okay, they have a little fuzzy on them? They do. Mine has a fuzzy. No, yours doesn't have fuzzy. Okay, so this has bumps. So why do you think that that helps us? Huh? So how does how does the tread on our shoes help us from bumping into something? What does it cause, G Gavin? It causes friction. time for you to learn so we have to we have to pay attention to what's happening it's not just to play so here's what we're going to do we are going to start off we're gonna almost play follow the leader is almost what it is and so I'm gonna be at the front of the line 
And you are going to do whatever I'm doing, which means then you have to do whatever the person in front of you is doing. And we are going to practice and feel what it's like on different surfaces to drag our feet. And so we're going to basically, we're going to, we're going to walk from this side of the room. So we're going to line up like we were going out this door. And then we're going to walk all around this room, out into the hallway, and back out this way. And you are going to shuffle step all the way. So you're, I'm going to show you. So you're going to shuffle step with your feet. So you are not going to pick up your feet to walk. So if my feet are on the ground, I'm not going to pick my feet up to walk like we normally do. I'm going to shuffle my feet. Like think about an old lady or an old man and they can't walk very well and they're shuffling their feet. Now, some of you will feel that your shoes, it's going to be easy to shuffle step. Some of you, you might say, oh my goodness, this is so hard. Like I can't make my shoes move because they have too much friction and they're holding my feet still on the ground and they're not letting my foot move enough. So, so what I want you to do is stand up, line up in line order, just like. Okay, so tell me while we're doing this. We're gonna shuffle our feet. And what are we gonna see? What are we gonna learn? How it feels. How it feels. And if we have a lot of friction, or just a little bit of friction. So when we get back, that's what I'm going to ask you. Is everybody ready? Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay. Let's go. Here's the, here's the next part. One way that we can get less friction is to change the surfaces. So that's going to be the next part of our experiment. And I have these plates. And to start with, we're going to do this twice. So we're going to get to walk around two more times, okay? So the first time, we are going to put just one plate under one foot. So what's that kind of like? You might have one of these. It's kind of like being on a what? Who has one? Do you know? It's not a skateboard, but like a, a, scooter. a scooter. Because a scooter, you put one foot on it and you push off with the other foot. I well, that's kind of like what you're gonna do here. You're gonna put one foot on the paper plate and you're not going to be able to pick that foot up. So you can only walk with one foot and slide the other one. So this time, we're not going to be shuffle stepping. We're going to be step, slide, step, slide, step, slide. And we'll probably be able to do this all the way around. So we won't have to stop because I, I didn't want you to put scuff marks in the hallway. So that's why I didn't want Mr. Chad and Miss Lisa to come fuss because we put black scuff marks from your shoes in the hallway. So what we're gonna do right now, I'm gonna give you one plate and you are gonna put that under one foot and we're gonna walk around and see what that feels like. Okay, is everybody ready? So you're gonna step and slide, step and slide. You do it frontwards, I'm just doing it backwards so I can video you. Keep going forward. I'm not ready. You have to hold the door yourself. I can't hold it. Keep coming. Don't pick your foot up. Keep that one down.
Oh, okay, so oh, now yeah. tell me what you noticed. It tell me what you happen. noticed when you were walking it with was, one, it, you have to raise your hand, with one foot on the plate and one foot off. What did you notice, Yin Kong? Emma? Okay, that one of them was slick and one of them wasn't. Cora? Um, Shh. Which one was harder? The ground. Oh, the one you were walking on. But which was harder to slide on? Was it the one that you, was it when you were on the tile or was it the one on the carpet? What do you think? The tile. You thought it was harder on the tile. Carpet. 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 Why did you think carpet? You don't think carpet? Kind like a zombie. It's kind of like zombie. I'm a zombie. Thank you.